Hi, Vadim here. In this quick and practical tutorial, you'll learn how to solve this common everyday problem step by step. Very frequently, you may need to edit a document that only exists as a scanned PDF. The good news? You can convert scanned PDFs into fully editable Word documents, either with Microsoft Word or using free alternatives. Let me walk you through both methods along with important tips so you don't waste time or lose formatting. Let's get started. First, we need to check the PDF type and quality. Before you even open the file, it's crucial to understand what kind of PDF you're dealing with. Some PDFs are scanned images, and this requires Optical Character Recognition, or OCR. But if your PDF was exported from Word document or software like Excel, it's already digital and editable, no OCR needed. You can usually tell by trying to highlight the text in a PDF viewer. If you can't select individual words or letters, it's the image-based scan. In this resume example, you can also compare the pictures and quickly see which one was exported directly from Word and which one was scanned. If you have Microsoft Word, it's by far the easiest and most accurate method. You can open document in Word by using file open method. When Word opens the file, it will prompt you with the message. Word will convert your PDF into an editable Word document. Click OK. Word will run OCR automatically and extract the text from the image. Now let's cover some important tips to make sure the conversion goes smoothly. Number one, image quality affects accuracy. Low resolution scans, blurred pages or handwriting may confuse the OCR engine. Aim for at least 300 DPI scans when possible. Another important consideration is that formatting might break. You may see misaligned tables, strange line spacing or headers pushed into the body text. Word does the best conversion, but it's not perfect. And this is exactly what we see in this document. Let's see how we can clean it up. Make sure to double check special characters. They often get scrambled. And you can also use Styles Pane to reapply consistent formatting. And once you cleaned up the formatting, make sure to save the document under new name to preserve the original PDF file. If you don't have a Word license, there are still great options available, but they come with a few trade-offs. You can upload scanned PDF to Google Drive and then right-click on the file and select Open with Google Docs. Google will run its own OCR engine and convert the scanned content into Google Docs file. Google's OCR engine works best for plain text documents like letters, form, and notes. You can also use free online OCR tools like Small PDF. It lets you upload the scanned PDF and download the converted Word file. But be careful, many free tools comes with limitations and privacy concerns. Another alternative is to use Microsoft Word Online. If you don't have a desktop version of Word, try Word Online at office.com. All you need is a free Microsoft account. You can open and edit Word documents online, which is perfect for lightweight tasks or occasional use. You can also try tools like LibreOffice, Tesseract OCR, or Capture to Text. These tools are free to download and let you either edit PDFs or run the OCR locally. These tools take a little bit more effort, but they're great if you prefer offline tools. If you found this content helpful, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to Online Training for Everyone. Have a great day!